what I'm saying about a home is I think a home sucks energy. I don't think it produces. Um, now, you're going to say, hey, Bitcoin doesn't produce anything either. You're right. You're right. It produces nothing. It doesn't even produce revenue, but it, what it should do is hold value. If there was only three of us invested in Bitcoin, I understand. You're probably right. Hey, look, big deal. There, there's 48 million people in the United States, somewhere between 320 to 400 million people on this planet that own Bitcoin that have decided today it's worth $26,000. That is a market by any stretch of the imagination. Okay, If I go to the UK and want to trade electricity, there might be 40 players. This is 400 million players that have decided Bitcoin is worth something that ethers want some, and then all the other coins. Like, if you really saw the population of people playing in these coins and you looked at their demographics, most people wouldn't be in these altcoins. Okay, if you look at the demographics of the people that are in Bitcoin, mm -hmm. very different quality of player. Interesting. Yeah. So no. So, so the, the, the home, look, no one figures mm -hmm. in the lifetime tax. Uh, you don't own your home. Okay, I don't care who's in here. You do not own your home if you don't pay your taxes your home gets taken away from mm -hmm. you, okay? So you don't own your home. I own Bitcoin. Like, nobody can take it away from me. They might put a tax on it, um, but they can't take it from me. Um, apartment dwellings, like, you know, for guys that really know how to run and operate an apartment building, I think that's cool. Um, great source of diversity. Uh, I own a lot of different things. It's not just... Uh, Bitcoin, um, but I don't. Well, this is what I don't own. I don't. I own two cars. I don't own Ferraris, and I don't. You know, I own a part of a plane, and that plane produces something for me. Yeah, uh, much more so than the the, the house. Um, if I throw a party at my house, no one walks into my house and goes, "Hey, do you rent this or do you own it?" Like, really? Are you that asshole? Yeah. Like, who cares, right? If I go out on a date, nobody cares if I rent it or own it. I mean, what, I'm more special because I have debt? Um, so, you know, the house, the you got to fix the yard, you got to fix the plumbing, you got to clean it, you got to paint it. Those suck. For an entrepreneur like you, why do you, why do you want to take your time and energy and deploy it into something that might give you a 5 or 6% return, if you're lucky, that can be built over and over and over and over again? Um, so I just don't see the long-term utility of owning a home, uh, for almost anyone, man, unless you just have so much excess cash.